their elimination game last night. Three and one to Alonzo. Williams sets. Here's the pitch. Swing on a fly ball to right field. Pretty well hit. Freelick back at the wall. He jumps. It's gone. He did it. He did it. Pete Alonso with the most memorable home run of his career. Pumps his fist as he rounds second. It's a three-run homer. He's given the Mets a 3-2 to two lead. They all pour out of the dugout. Alonso on his way to home plate. They're waiting for him. He hits the plate. He is first congratulated by Nimmo. Hugged by Lindor. There are a dozen Mets waiting for him. Him outside the dugout. Pete Alonso keeps this fairy tale season going with the fairy tale swing of his career. Just awesome. Three that, to two New York. That's how he rose the longtime mm. voice of the Mets. And that is a master class great on call. how to do a great play-by-play call in a big moment. Just, just real quick, take stock of this. Elimination game. The Mets are listless. They're down 2 nothing after two solo home runs by the Brewers. This is it, the ninth inning. Alonso has not hit a home run in almost a month. He's batting like 110 in the last couple of weeks they get two guys on and then you get that home run which obviously wins in the end they tacked on an insurance run with Winker a little bit later on in the inning and that's how you eliminate the Milwaukee Brewers, and set up this great match, as you know, is going to be on Fox starting this weekend. Mets, Phillies, hated rivals, Hatfields and McCoys. I may have started a campaign called Foo Philly many, many years ago because we hate Philadelphia. But the Mets also did something last night that small market teams do, and I love it. They opened up City Field where they play their home games and had fans come in to watch the game for three hours. These poor people are miserable. And then Alonzo gets up, two men on. And I want to show you the home run. And at the same time, watch about 10,000 Met fans at City Field celebrating. Go ahead. William sets. Here's the pitch. Swing on a fly ball to right field. Pretty well hit. Freelick back at the wall. He jumps. Oh, it's yeah. Gone. He did I it. Mean, he did that's it. Awesome. Pete Alonso and with the most memorable home run of his career. Pumps his fist. So he Williams, seven, who's one of the best closers in baseball, has never in his lead. career given up an opposite field home run. That was the first. And there's also a bit of a convoluted stat. In the history of baseball, in an elimination game, no team has ever hit the game-winning home run while trailing in the ninth inning. That's the first time Dude, that has that ever is, happened. That is insane. And that pitch, by the way, that pitch is outside. you got to let that ball travel, yep. hit it to the opposite field. It's a great piece of hitting by Pete Alonso, And that, just an amazing moment. Th- that, that fact about trailing ninth yeah. inning postseason go-ahead home run or game-winning home run, it's never happened in baseball history. I made everyone fact-check that multiple times before the show. <laughs> I was like, I was like, I was like, well, I was like, how? I was like, baseball history, baseball history is a lot of history. And there were a lot of historic home runs in baseball playoff history. Sure. So for that to have never happened, and I understand there's a couple of qualifiers attached to it, and then for it to be Alonzo and his history with the Mets and his history with Mets fans and how poor it's been going recently, like they can't be feeling great with him up there in that spot and then he delivers. That is one of the great iconic power hitters in Mets history. That could have been his last at bat as a Met. He's a free right. agent hey, after if, this. If it goes if the other way. Try, yeah. By the way, if you try to pull that ball, you're out. You're out. Now, you're out. I will say this. One guy had a tough time celebrating at City Field. You guys may know I love popcorn. Madison Square Garden. Oh, everybody knows popcorn that. Ever. Look at the guy in the red there. <laughs> oh, the orange. Can you guys start that again one more time? Watch the guy in the red. Lower right of your screen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, wait. That was $30 for that popcorn. <laughs> That's worth it. So, just to recap for baseball, uh, you have Mets Phillies on Fox. Obviously, the uh, NLDS is all on Fox. You've got LA San Diego, a huge series there. San Diego eliminated them two years ago. Little playoff revenge right. for Shoei oh, Otani, of course, and Mookie Betts and Dave Roberts. So, the National League is stacked. American League wise, Yankees Kansas City starts Saturday night, Yankee Stadium, and you get Detroit Cleveland. So, it should be a that, great postseason that is. of baseball, culminating with the World Series on Fox.